what's up guys welcome back to another video so in today's video we are going to be learning how to put admin commands in your roblox game so if you already have your game opened just skip this um so for all, we're just going to go to create i'm just going to put it on my group but then you're going to do create new game and then whichever you can just fiddle with these or whatever and select whichever one you want and then create game Okay, so then we have it here. And then you want to click edit. And just go into Roblox Studio. So if you're already in Roblox Studio, you can just skip this. So now we are in Roblox Studio. And so you just go into your toolbox. Mine may look may look a bit different than you, so than yours, so you're just gonna go in view and make sure Explorer properties and toolboxes selected. That's all you need for this tutorial. And if you search up admin, I'm going to be using HD admin for this tutorial because I just think it's the best. And then you should open this, you can delete the thumbnail camera and then a boat, so you can just delete this as well. And you just leave these in workspace so for the settings you want to go into settings and then we actually have to make a game pass now so you want to go you want to go on this page and then you have to click store and it says add pass right here and then so you just want to choose you can either make a game pass picture or whatever but you don't I mean you don't have to I'm probably just going to choose a random one I'll just do this one I guess I already have some made and then description you don't have to do it but whatever um and then preview and then verify upload so then you want to click on it and it'll bring you to this page. It doesn't matter if it's for sale or not, but obviously you'll have to put it for sale if you're making a game pass. And you see these three little numbers, or these, not three, but these numbers here. Yours will be different than mine. But you'll have these these numbers here. So you want to copy them by clicking Control C or Command C on MacBook. Um, and then you see how it says Game Pass is right here, and it says, like, this is VIP. So VIP is. Um, is like the first rank of admin so you see how it says right here vip then mod then admin then head head admin then owner so we're just gonna go right here and then put the game pass id if you want to add more you just copy this oh whoops that's not what i was trying to do you just copy this and then you just put it right there and then you can put another game pass in or game pass id in and then you can just change it to um, like mod, for example, or admin or whatever. I wouldn't. I would. I don't know. I wouldn't put. I wouldn't make a game pass that makes people have head admin because it's kind of OP. But anyways, I'm just gonna delete that. Um. So then this is really all and then we'll just try it out. So we we have this game pass I'm just gonna put it for sale So you just go to sales and then put it for sale. I'll just do I'll do 700 or a million or walks. sounds good I'm just gonna just go play and let's see if we have it Oh, why is it not working? Hey, let's just try and do it in a in a normal game. Or if we just go to the game, like not in Roblox Studio, is what I mean. We'll just make it public. Okay, so then play it and we'll see if it works.
Not my user. Okay. So we have the owner rank, but even it'll still work. Like you see how it says right here. I've been Robux and this VIP. So then you just click unlock and it costs a million Robux. And if you guys want in the future, I'll make a Roblox Studio tutorial and make a Game Pass GUI. So when you click a button, it pops up like a Game Pass purchase. I, I may do that, I may not, I'm not sure. Um, well, that is pretty much it. See you guys later. Bye.